What's up, YouTube? It's your boy JP and David back out again with another video. So today we have the custom Black Bolt sent to us by Jay Holmes or Josh Holmes. Nice. Um, thank you for sending it this way for us to check out. Really appreciate it. Uh, shout out to you. Uh, and so this is a custom piece. Looks like a, it recently came out. I forgot what studio this is one from. But I never really got too much into the Black Bolt character. Yeah. I just felt like this one was actually pretty badass in the pictures. Yeah. So I was like, yeah, let me just review it real quick. We'll go sell it. Yeah. <laughs> a Black Bolt is one of those characters that I would say is very good as a supporting character, but mm -hmm. not really like a main character. But he's strong. I mean, yeah. he's part of the Illuminati, or he was. So he's always been like like mm -hmm. the strongest... Um, what is it, Eternals? No, uh, Inhumans. Inhumans, Inhumans. Yeah. Inhumans. But if for those of you guys who read the comics, definitely let us know what is the best Black Bolt storyline to yeah. read because we never read Black Bolt before. Yeah. Uh, I would like to know more about him because he is like a really OP character. He could blow up the world just by talking. So yeah. if there's really good ones, definitely let me know because I feel like the TV show kind of was a letdown. That's why I got canceled. <laughs> stuff like that. So, but yeah. Did you see that the same actor played Black Bolt in, uh, in uh, Fantastic <laughs> in, Four? I mean, sorry, uh, movie? Doctor Strange? Yeah. Yeah. That was... That was We'll see how it goes. Yeah. yeah. But uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing experience. We'll see you guys at, at the end. So we just finished building out the XM, not XM, Black Bolt, custom custom statue Black Bolt. This yeah. is by far the easiest build. Super. One, one of the easiest build because it's just the base, his body, and his two hands in the portrait. So like five pieces. Yeah. Other than that, it's really, really quick. Uh, the base is cool. I, yeah. I dig it. It was, he was staying on the statue. Not yeah. too bad. I wonder what that is. That, that's really interesting like uh -huh. you know they, they it's I mean it's on the base but I wonder who it is yeah uh, I do like this black uh, and white bolt mm -hmm. uh, lightning bolt base which is really cool I think that definitely fits him his suit yeah so that's really cool I like that a lot yeah I feel like the detail the reason why I wanted to check out the statues because the details on him was really cool I like the you know the veins and everything the paint the paint was spectacular yeah I, I feel like they did a really good job making this one uh, again, the action pose for me, it's okay. It's a three. The base is a three for me. 
Uh, yeah. It's nothing like really stands out. It's not like a centerpiece or something that when you walk into a gallery, it's the one that sticks out. I don't feel like this is the one that will stick out. That's true. But I feel like if you have like the entire Inhuman line or the, all the characters, and definitely it will look really cool as a gallery altogether. Yeah, this is definitely like one of those, uh, what is it called, the museum piece? Yeah, museum pose? Yeah, museum pose where it's kind of just like the base. Like you said, if you had other ones, you could put it together. Maybe all of the Illuminati, like, mm. you know, Professor X, uh, Iron Man, all yeah. of them, put in, uh, you know, Black, uh, Black Panther. All together, that would be cool, like a, like a Illuminati kind of centerpiece. Uh, but yeah, again, three out of five. Action pose, he's just kind of standing on the head. Three out of five. Yeah. The finish, I would give it definitely a five. Five out of five for sure. With yeah. the finish and paint, and the, just the details on the veins and everything. Dude, was yeah. Solid. And then the the fabric looks like like real fabric. The shoes, I'm like, those look like really cool. Like, let me give me a pair of those. You know? Is he wearing the Yeezys? <laughs> <laughs> are those are those the Nikes or Reebok? I mean, I mean, who makes them? Uh, but yeah, and I really like the switch on heads as you saw. So I I mean, I know the regular bald, black bald head like this. Uh, the other one, he has black eyes. I don't know why. So you know, if you do know, let us know. Why does black bald eyes turn black? Or is this, you know, a different mode? And I've yeah. never seen this other one this at one all. As well. Let me know if it's this like, is this how he looks like when he goes like full Super Saiyan or something? <laughs> <laughs> let, let us know, because I've never seen him like this either. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, but yeah, you know, besides that, just besides kind of like the kind of basic uh, base and basic stand, the statue is really nice. If you're a, flan a, a fan of Black Bolt, this is definitely something you would want to get. Mm -hmm. um, but like we were talking about earlier, like, you know, Black Bolt to me has been a... OP character, but he's kind of like in the background. He's, yeah. of course, he can't talk, so he yeah. can't really express himself very yeah, much. You don't really get too much from him in comics yeah. and movies and stuff like that because of the way his his powers are built and everything. Yeah. But overall, I, I would like to know more. So if you guys know any Black Bolt stuff, definitely let us know. What's your favorite Black Bolt statue? Favorite, favorite storyline? Yeah. Let story us know what you think about this this piece. And uh, leave a comment down below, subscribe, hit the notification bell, all that good stuff. And we'll see you guys in the next video.